Hey guys, so welcome, welcome back to War of the Chosen, the better everything. Let's carry on where we left off, Operation Unholy Priest. We've got to stop the Advent Retaliation. It'll be our first mission against the Chosen. We're taking out Atlas, Canellus, Carver, Shearer, Hansen, Yellow. Let's go. I don't know if it's going to be the Warlock. I just, you know, made the assumption because it's his Unholy Priest. It could be the Assassin. It could be the Hunter. Sky We're in the pipe. Five by five. Another short trip. Thanks, Firebrand. We just got word the aliens are hitting a resistance outpost with everything they've got, and our people don't stand a chance against them. We're heading in to secure the area. Eliminate all enemy contacts. Alright, Defiance Valley. We can do this, guys. As long as we don't miss all those 85% shots this time, I'll be happy. Alrighty. Hostile forces are attacking the outpost. Eliminate all enemy units and protect those civilians. Advent oh. came in hot and so did we. You won't have a concealed position for deployment on this one. He's right. I don't have anyone concealed, so we're going to engage with the enemy as soon as we Focus find them. On the job at hand. So let's take care right. as we move along. I'm on the move. And there we go. Advent forces sighted. Six -way soldier and two troopers. <sighs> All right. How lucky. They're all posted next to that uh, gigantic truck. Well, Catch! let's give them a nice little welcome. <laughs> that worked out quite well. Okay. Good start. I can do Wrath on the Sectoid Soldier, which is nice. They're technically sectoids we shouldn't be allowed to do that but because it's a sectoid soldier we can um which means they're not susceptible to melee attacks which is why wrath is still only four damage all righty all good 50 percent on the trooper and sectoid soldiers are more likely to to fire rather than do their psi attacks on might need some a rookie's touch here. Think it missed. Nope. We did damage, just not enough. Sad. Position confirmed. Alright, let's get Mellow over there. Go on the sectoid. No dice. This is rubbish. Trooper. Unfortunate. Which means Mellow, just overwatch please. Here we go. Oh, of all the... So many have already fought. It had to be the assassin. God, she's the worst one to start off with. Low profile and immune to damage. Oh, I hate low profile as well. Oh my god, this is going to be a disaster. Is never done. Let's click one of these windows to break here. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> it's the Every time. Assassin, and she's moving into the AO. Oh man, we couldn't save Anton Sarpus. Whoa, 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 whoa. Watch out! Okay. Here we go. Flank. Rolling. Nice easy kill for you, please. Eighty-two percent. Wonderful. Target neutralized. Uh, let's go. For another flank. Awesome. Infantry there is down. no shame in their defeat. They know nothing of their actions. Uh, but thankfully we've got uh, Adler Scout here with us. Yeah, I got that. Which will help us because that's one of the Chosen's weaknesses. You are perhaps the lowliest of all the wretched creatures inhabiting this world. Look on your death today. As an act of kindness on my part. Gee, thanks. Doing I'm me a back. favor. Got it covered. Unfortunately, she doesn't take extra damage Got it. as her weakness. It's just easier to target from high ground. And the way I see it, the only high ground I can see is this tower. So, if we can get Adlis there ASAP, that'd be wonderful. What are you talking about? I'm just explaining the mechanics of how we're going to defeat the assassin, okay, Kyra? Jeez. 
She won't be taking too long, I assume. Let's get up here. A useful aid. Nothing. Something. It would seem Advent has begun a sniper, to the trooper, trooper, into heavy. Their implants provide significant enhancements to whatever latent psionic energy they may have once possessed. Uh, let's go on the 99. Your fish. Here we go. One down. They exist to serve the elders, to fight and die on the field of battle. Don't have a lot of high cover, which is unfortunate. And these guys are way behind. So we're gonna need a we're gonna need to commit a turn to just dashing up, I think. Uh let's get our cannon. Mr. Shearer. I'll move him up here, that's probably overcommitting. I'll put him here. Good to go. Let's move Hansen up here. Yeah. Let's move Mellow. Black and Was that? Oh shit, she's here. Your lives, your resistance must end. Damn it, we're in no position to take it down. You return to captivity, Commander. Okay, we're gonna need to just take some. You won't suffer long by my hand. We need to take some uh, low cover. Time to put it down. To set ourselves up. Ugh, this is a terrible, terrible spot we've put ourselves in. Mellow there. Overwatch, Overwatch. Even though it's a shotgun, it's probably not the greatest idea. Serve your masters well. Destroy all who stand in your way. Stasis. Okay. That guy's running off. Don't jump! It's okay! We'll rescue you! I think. Heavy. Oh god. Nice shot. Man, these guys aren't showing any mercy. They're just killing all the civilians. Wow. Uh, she's vanishing. Okay, that buys us some time. You that I find you? You're the one who just disappeared, okay? Uh, I don't have the greatest shots. Uh... Okay. Let's, let's take this slowly but surely. Let's fire twice on the heavy. One more. Nice. AP rounds coming through. My weapon is almost depleted. Move up here. Uh, Overwatches aren't going to do us much good, actually, because I think she. Skips over the overwatches when she goes in for the slash. Jeez, do we just not have any grenades? Need to invest more in our explosive grenades. Rolling. Let's move over here. Oh, we've got another shot on her. I'll take it. Go, flank. Nice crit. Overwatch there. Flash them towards me. Ugh, really? I wanted to put you next to the tree, but it's not happening. Oh, I can guide you though. Just run up here. Come this side. Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> Why? This is happening. Alright. Added a bit of difficulty in this encounter. About some kind of shapeshifters. I'm guessing this is it. It is a remarkable species. 
thought that blue guy was about to turn into a faceless as well. Holy warrior? Okay. I'll take it. Yeah, run, run, run. Sniper. Oh, big money. Ran right into the sniper's crosshair. We're running out of time. That sniper needs to go. He's just hunkered down out back. Ah. No rock can break this wave. Here she goes. And Wait, what? Since when? <laughs> okay. I'll take it. I didn't realize you could resist. We've got a flank, which is nice. Probably didn't realize that he was flanked because she was in stasis. Faster reloads are always good. Go. Good, good. Alan, you wanna maybe finish this guy off? Moving on target. Let's just go for a zap. There he goes. Yeah, okay. I can hear the quivering in your voice. Uh, can I get eyes on that sniper? Otherwise, I'll just slash the assassin. Probably not the greatest idea, actually. There we go. 11%. Down. Nineteen. Why is it so low? Is it just because? Oh, he's in high cover, really? Oh, I suppose on this side he is. Yeah, he's he's got himself locked in a fortress. More of watches, unfortunately. Come here. Okay. I've cornered them. He's overwatching. There we go. Nice. Something landed. Oh, good. Skirmish shot. And the AP rounds. Really? I feel so lucky right now. I will leave you with no questions. Come here. Let's use both barrels on her. <laughs> this is like... <laughs> really? That tickled. Okay. Uh... 59%. I stand for the forgot repositioning. Ooh, nice. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. She took some damage, though, because he must have fired during the overwatch, but... She got rid of him. Plug her. Okay. That could have been a whole lot worse. I don't know what she did at the end there. She didn't even once go for a slice. So it pains me to flee from a worthy adversary. One last enemy to go. I'm sure we'll see them again, but that chosen sure wasn't expecting the fight we put up today, Commander. No, it sure wasn't. Ready to engage. Let's get Atlas out of there before she gets smashed by that faceless. And maybe rescue a civilian while we're at it so we can feel good about ourselves. Launch safety. There we go. Hell yes. Well done, guys. Scanning. Better look out now. Fantastic effort. Got really lucky though. Enemy is still up! Yeah, lucky I moved her out of there. That base just could have smashed her easily. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Not really? as nice. Focus okay, Hector over here. 
really? There we go. This is it. Don't choke now, guys. We've made it to the end. Cool. Reload. Fire. Venice one five. Status confirmed. We're not picking up any additional contacts. The AO is clear. Status well, confirmed. Mission accomplished. That went a Great lot job, better than I expected. We sent the chosen a lot back to better. their masters with a few scars to show for their effort. If they decide to face us again, we'll be ready. MVP was Adlusk, most high, most exposed solo slayer, kill stealer. Spike Canellis. Two kills. He did miss that 87% shot or something at the end, right? Most assists. Close range, heavy hitter, wanton destruction, one out of three. Everyone's most hated unit. Oh, no. Alan's most hated unit was that Advent Trooper. He took one shot and it landed. Even though he technically got a kill with the Zapper as well on the Priest. Astrid, no kills, uh, unfortunately. She was a rookie, but she did a lot of damage on that Priest. She basically set him up to die, which is nice. Mellow Yellow, one kill, five damage dealt, two out of three percentage. Well done. Alright, of course, our usual photo booth moment. There we go. Let's get out of here. Advent peacekeepers responded to reports of an insurgent camp located in the Outer Territories. Despite a heroic battle, several dangerous insurgents managed to evade capture due to a treacherous ambush by XCOM. Dangerous insurgents. That's what we are now, eh? I'll take it. I'll take it. Welcome home, troops. At least we know these Chosen can be killed. Well, temporarily. This definitely went a lot better than I thought. Atlas is tired. She deserves a much needed rest now. Uh, let's promote everyone else. Hansen, you are a Sabature. Nice to see. Probably got inspired by Alan Shearer there. Uh, we've got Hector. Beatdown, Mayhem, or Covert. Uh, beat down, strike an enemy with the butt of your weapon, dealing only little damage but stunning the target. Can only be used on unarmored targets. Uh, if it stuns them, I'll be happy to take that. Uh, Mayhem, I don't really think I'm going to be suppressing much with Hector. I should probably consider it, but I don't think I'm going to use it that much. Covert, eh, he's not really a scout, so he shouldn't be needing to get that close to the enemy anyways. So let's go for beatdown. It'll be nice. So we can either use our double barrel shotgun... Or our sawn-off shotgun, sorry. Or we can beat down to stun them. Carver. Blade Master. Take under or seek and destroy. Take under a slash attack with your sword that always hits and doesn't end the turn. Can only be used against wounded targets on three or less health. So this is like a, a finishing move of sorts. It always hits. Doesn't end the turn. Like a sand and slash. Dash into a target and slashing him will still only cost one action, but you need to have two actions currently available to dash. Okay. Or Blade Master. Also, in text deal two extra damage. I'll just take Blade Master. We can use it on all enemies. Alan, Shearer, Stun, Bombard, Taunt, Bombard, gain one bonus use on all your grenades. Stun, Taunt, decrease defense by 30, increase dodge by 70. Uh, I like Stun, I also like Bombard. This will allow him to sort of, like, destroy the enemy's cover a lot. Let's go for Bombard. Mello, you are a specialist. Awesome. There's a Bond, I think. Here we go, Carver and Hansen. Let's do it. Carver and Hansen, the ultimate fire team with two combined kills. All of them Carvers. Let's do it. I like it. It's just, see, it's that little bit of technic- it's like the technically it's the truth. Two combined kills. She just has zero and he has two. They're the ultimate fire team. Wonderful. Sure that wraps it up. Spandin Mag. Our pals over at XCOM put a beat down on the aliens so bad, those creepy green tubes they were born in are probably still shaking. <laughs> they keep this up. We might just win this thing. Don't Excellent jinx it. Work, Commander. Oh God! Your all this praise. To bolster the resistance movement across the globe. Stop it, guys. It's gonna be the end of me. There we go. Supplies. Your tenacity could prove your undoing, Commander. If 
you would seek a fight with me, I hope you are truly ready to match my skill. Alright, let's finish up the engineer. We'll go for the rookies, because I actually need more soldiers on this roster. So the st supplies will wait. We've got a supply Priority drop anyway. Message coming through, Commander. Putting it on screen now. I had high hopes for the resistance under your leadership, Commander. And you have outdone yourself. Right. She's planning to reduce our income, as they normally do. Rapid response or dark tower. Okay. This doesn't matter too much because these dark events, no matter which one we don't count it, doesn't activate until the next round of dark events, so that's all good. Utilize the resistance. Weak points. Decoys. Uh, am I worried about the Chosen getting too much knowledge? Not really, since we stopped her straight away. So let's go for any shredding attack. Adds one shred to the target, which is nice. We don't have a resistance ring yet, so we'll have to wait on that. Uh, can't do anything, except for locate the Templar, so let's do that. This is how I rank up my rookies. I just grab two random ones that will get a skill. I think it's better than putting one person at a time through the uh, Guerrilla Tactics School. I don't get to choose their class, but it gets the job done. Especially since I don't have not created equal or anything, so it's not too bad. So let's get a Templar. I'll definitely need to grab one round of supplies. Ooh, Jesus Lopez. Welcome. Once I regrouped, we will be seeing each other again. Commander, okay, she's definitely trying to make up for her loss. To track down the chosen. We should construct the ring facility so they have a place to coordinate. Look at that, the two bonded uh, soldiers here, Ling and Atlas, and we got Carver and Hanson there. Canellas tending bar. How lovely. They're probably celebrating the fact that they got their own poster. All good in the hood. Aside from us getting this ship up and running, which was no one there. mostly Dr. Shen's work, I haven't felt particularly useful one person in a long time. I'm more than happy to leave the hardest. Commander, we've got local resistance forces waiting to make contact. Let's just touch the rookies. To the first move. Not in that way, I just mean scan a little bit so it doesn't disappear, okay? There we go. Grab the supply so I can increase the starting... Oh, not the starting, but the, the squad size. Give us more of a chance. There we go. Avenger plotting new course. Khadija, you're back! Welcome back. Uh, before I forget as well, let's purchase that upgrade. In combat tactics, squad size. Oh, Penny, that's you. Training. Oh, there's another poster in the back there. We are chosen. So looking forward to... Um, tactical Legacy Pack dropping tomorrow. When it does, I'm gonna do the story missions and I'll share them with you guys. My my adventures through Our them. Research was a success, Commander. And I'm also looking forward to all the cosmetics that they provide, man. They all look so cool. Interchangeable upgrades. Uh, yeah, you know, it's not the most important thing in the world. Maybe we're better off doing another. Maybe let's start. Put the mag weapons, or let's do resistance radio. Now let's get the I mag agree. weapons first. That is an important radio is not a huge sort of priority. We can now work to establish contact with local resistance groups operating out of regions around the globe. Once we've collected sufficient intel to make contact, we'll need to scan the target region for the operative signal. I'm only planning on making contact with two regions at the beginning. Otherwise, we start spreading to the other chosen, and then we get like double teamed and it's just our next a bit operation much. will put us right in the middle of chosen territory commander there's a good chance they'll show up to interfere so we should plan accordingly operation spider child neutralize the field commander it's easy we we'll get Any scientists out of it Mexico. sounds good to me let's get down there let me set up the team all right, Operation Spider Child neutralize the field commander. Easy. We're taking out Zhao, Kauri, McNay, Hanson, Carver, Canellis, Norris. Let's do this. It's Monday. We're going to make this multi-mission Monday. Because, you know, there's no missions over the weekend. Why the hell not? Let's go. Episode recording was short already. Sky Ranger deployed. Squad green to deploy. Let's drop on down. We've been given a prime opportunity to disrupt Advent's operations and delay their current plans. 
One of their field commanders has decided to tour the actual field, and we're going to make sure he never leaves there alive. Once you hit the ground, find our target and eliminate him as quickly as possible. I wonder why he's touring under, in the tunnels under Albuquerque. Anyway. Ooh, right, of course. This is one of the map packs I've got. Menace 1-5, we're tracking the Advent General and his escorts, but we don't have an exact fix on their location. Sweep the area and eliminate the target along with any other hostiles that stand in your way. Right, of course. Anyway, this is one of the map packs I've got, so it makes things... Gives us a little more variety in locations. This obviously looks like a very familiar location. We've got location scouts, so we've got access to where... Well, not where, but the knowledge of where everyone is hiding, which is nice. So there's the Advent General there, so let's make a beeline for him, shall we? Choose your next words carefully. Slay okay. that dog already! Wow, she's like the Terminator, man. Let's <laughs> calm down, Khadija. I know you haven't, you haven't been in the field in a while, but goodness me. This better be good, or you're wasting me time. Damn right! It's gonna be fine. Coming! Heading out the trap. So let's all focus on this side of the map. Stepping off. This looks like a pretty simple map, right? Just... I don't know, I can't really see a lot of full cover, though. <laughs> looks like an arena, to be honest. Times like this, a girl dreams of violence. All right. I know, I know, you've lost your child and everything, but there's no need for a death wish. Okay, let's avenge them. Alright, these guys moving to block our path. We might need to go through them. That soldier's ready to attack anything that comes into its line of sight. <laughs> Same with that sectoid. Okay. Fortunately, I don't have a sharpshooter. Which sucks, but it is what it is. Okay. Uh. Yep. Why do you bother me? Kind of need to go through these guys, unfortunately. All right. But let's just move up slowly. See, there's not a lot of cover uh, for us to take advantage of on a blue move. Heading out. There. There. I think we'll just overwatch another turn. The timer doesn't start until we engage with the enemy, so... Let's... Problem. Use that to our advantage. Any like in a room. I have a bad feeling Canalis will get spotted where he is. So I'll move him here. Out. Where he's also likely to get spotted, but at least he won't be, like, less likely, so to speak. Overwatch. Um. Just hunker down. Just waiting on you. Overwatch. Oh, come on. And you'll also Let's have to hunker down. Do this okay. I tire of waiting. A lot of hunkering down going on. Okay, they're on the move. Should be able to shoot them in the back. Yeah, these guys aren't going to be an issue. Which is good. One less problem to deal with. Okay, they're literally at the back of the map. Who knew this was under Albuquerque? I thought it was going to be the rank tunnels. And these guys get to move close to us. Now I can see why he's touring it, you know, it's like an underwater world. He gets to, like, look at the fish. What a lucky bastard. Eagle. Let's just start with Canellis. Let's go on the... Let's go on the trooper. Okay. God's sake! This was like our one chance! Good news is they don't get too much cover either. Okay, well this is going to be annoying, isn't it? Especially because moving up there is going to trigger those guys. Moving up there is going to trigger them. Eek, maybe I just have to trigger them. Surely not. Let's come over here. 69, 65. Damn it! Could always count on Khadija before. Oh, she's got nothing to say this time. 
I right? This way. Oh god! Did you like blast him in half, or is it just it's just clipping issues? But it looks like he like blasted the guy in half, and his his legs went flying somewhere. Uh, we've got a hail of bullets. My, I know I shouldn't be saving abilities. Let's get Drake to hollow target the officer. Give us a chance at shooting him. So a little bit extra aim. Forty-seven. Nice. It's the anime here. I'm telling you. Forty-two. Wow, we land two forties. Oh, That's pretty good. Come on. Let's go. Move up. Let's spray. I don't think this is going to destroy the cover. Actually, I think it's a built-in part of the map. Uh, so the. Well, we can't overwatch. It's just fire. <laughs> what? Okay. I'm quick. You're dead. See, this is why I can't really complain about the low percentage shots we get. A lot of the time, we just land our low percentage ones, so it kind of balances out in the end. Works for me. We're picking up an inbound advent transport. The aliens are going to try and extract the general from the AO. Don't let him get on board that ship. All right, let's go before he leaves this theme park of fish. Oh, he's just casually, they're like, oh, sir, we've got an emergency, you need to leave. He's just like, oh, really? I don't want to leave that soon. I want to see the eels. So now he's just, like, stumbling out of here. Uh, we need to get his attention. Khadija. Oh, actually. Oh, uh, let's get someone else. Maybe Canellus. I want her to use her slash abilities and stuff. Threat spotted. If they come close enough. He's like, oh, they're here, really? Damn it. Alright, jellyfish, hold on. I'll talk to you in a moment. Oh, I can't reach with the incendiary grenade. Sucks. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. Stab him. Right in the chest. Good. 55%. Wow, looks like a crit. No, it wasn't. <laughs> Could have been. 34, 18. I'd love to hold a target, but I don't think we're going to get it in range. Rolling. And we can't flank the guy because of this gigantic thing in the middle there. So maybe I should have just blasted that trooper. Uh, I can always slash. Let's do that. Nice, I like that shot. Stand. What? That's like three. What are you talking about? Anyway, let's do teamwork. Stay on it! Get him out of there. Can he slash his way out of here? He could, but it's not gonna kill him. But more damage is damage. Five. Eighteen percent. Maybe now we'll suppress. I guess. Death will come when you least expect it. Understood. Moving out. Let's let's pinch him. Uh, move up. Got it. Four percent. Not happening. Oh, I could launch a grenade, but it's an HE grenade. Not gonna do too much damage, unfortunately. I think I stopped listening to you an hour ago. All right. Sorry. Don't Jeez. worry. That's what I, I get for giving worry. orders. These guys just don't realize there's some hectic action going on. There we go. No watches? Okay. These guys don't realize that there's a huge firefight going on. I used to have this mod called Idle Suppression that was really cool, but the thing would crash a lot. Nice, good suppression. Basically what would happen is, um, if you hadn't some selected someone, they'd just be doing what Canals was doing, just suppressing each other. It looked like a huge firefight, and it was so awesome to see. But, uh, like I said, the thing kept crashing. Which sucks. Hope they fix it one day. 
Oh, that's not a flank. That's a mistake. Alright, kill this guy then. Okay, never mind. Khadija. She's getting a bit rusty. She's been in the mid bay for a bit. She's gone completely silent now. What happened? This will be a flank. There we go. That was mine. Oh, I thought he was about to... You said mine, right? Not nine. Otherwise, they'll be... You'll be going backwards in your count. Probably should have gone for hail of bullets there. We'll do that next time. Uh, because I've got a marksman stock on this rifle, if I don't move, I can stabilize and fire weapon, which gives us the extra boost and aim. I think that's pretty cool. A uh, way to mitigate the scopes um, sort of buff. Position confirmed. Makes you think twice before having to move. Which is why it's really useful on snipers who you don't really want moving anyway. So it gives us that extra 5%. Didn't help though. <laughs> Fortunately, Drake's too far back to okay. use his hollow target, so let's move him up a bit more. Reload. Top left, Overwatch, shoot. Overwatch. I shoot. I like this arrangement. Ow, oh, really? A crit? Well, it looks like Khadija's out. For another month. I need help. I know. Looks like that whole experience humbled her, though. You know, you can't be badass all the time, unfortunately. That's okay. You can heal yourself if you need to. Might just do that. Uh, you need to reload now. Moving to designated Let's move up here. coordinates. Let's hollow target. We come here. That's a flank. Let's move the carver here. Since he's not as wounded. Wow. Jeez. That was good. Heal yourself. Go. Let's go on the trooper. Awesome. 73. Good shot. You're doing quite well. On the leg. 24%. <laughs> yeah, you crit me through full cover. I'll crit you through full cover. Nice, she found a resolve in the end, which is always nice to see. I like these little mini storylines that we get out of each mission. More to this place than yeah. the eye. It's one of the cool things about XCOM that I love. Alright, last pod. They're coming down the road. This was a pretty basic pod um, makeup, right? Three in each one. That's a flank on the sectoid if we can get there, but is it safe? Probably not. We'll see what I can make happen. See, now we can use our killer bullets on this guy. Chest over here! Best shot on Pandora! Good, good. I can slash if I want to. Test my resolve, if you wish. Here we go. Nice. Another crit. She's just critting everything right now. She's had enough. Abby. How did that now? Let's get Drake there. Uh, what kind of shots are we looking at here? Not the greatest. 28% to zap. Let's kill a trooper. Good. Can't it be much longer now? I know, this is one left. There we go. Targeted for elimination. wrong with me? It's okay. It was a low percentage shot. It's 
Chest cover's gone. Uh, what? Can I get a shot off? No. We have to stand out in the open. Are we willing to take that risk? Ask your mic. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Let's do it. 83. Wonderful. Got out. Good teamwork, guys. Fortunately, Khadija did get wounded. 11 out of 11. Deaths. Ling, Wanton Destruction, Solar Slayer, Kill Stealer, Khadija, Most Assists, Abby, Not Bad Kid, Astrid, Nothing Again, Unfortunately, the combined kills is all Carver, but uh, she did well with the team up, and she destroyed the cover at the end there, so let's not forget her contributions, Carver, the MVP, 4 kills, Close Range, Heavy Hitter, Most Exposed, Overqualified, Canellus, Sneakiest, <laughs> Sure, Sneakiest. He had a clear shot behind someone when they didn't know we were there and he missed. And Drake. The unsung hero. No awards, but he did a lot of holo targeting. I think he should have got most assists, to be honest. Thanks for letting us visit your wonderful little water park here that you took your commander in so we could kill him. And that's one for the memories and for the scrapbook. Advent administration again reminds you that the recent assassination of an Advent civilian worker by the criminal organization known as XCOM is no cause for alarm. Advent peacekeepers have already moved to arrest those responsible. Advent civilian carrying a rifle, really. Okay. Now. My issue is, from here on out, things start getting a bit more hectic. To expect the best, and that's what you've shown them. Twenty days. Well done. Only one promotion as well with McNay. Reverse engineering haywire protocol or entrench. Hunker down last until you move. Haywire protocol. Reverse engineering when you kill an enemy robotic unit, you gain a permanent hacking increase of five, which is cool. I like it. Um, it'll be cool to mix the, these two together. So once I get the training facility. Definitely something I need to consider. But how often am I going to remember that she can kill a robotic unit, you know? Let's go with Haywire Protocol for now. And that can be a bonus later on down the track. Uh, otherwise, yeah. Well done. Advanced Penetrator Scope. Shots from the sweeping can't be dodged. Adds plus two armor piercing. More fragments. You have done an outstanding job leading the resistance, Dixon Morgan. Commander. Mag weapon's only 31 days now, which is nice. Anyone in here? Nope, but our latest picture. Obama standing around. Our courageous friends at XCOM successfully tracked any. Sorry, I didn't get to listen to that. Gorilla Op. Another one. In case I wanted to counter that. Avenger plotting new course. The other one, but uh maybe not so soon because we've got a lot of tired troopers. Debris cleared. Time for the resistance ring, let's go. The sooner we get this up, the better. 12 days, though. 7 days until that. We can't do any covert actions without the resistance ring, unless it's month end. So, once this is done, we won't be able to choose another one until that resistance ring is done. We are not all that dissimilar. Obama's back. We have both lost. Penny's done. We're training. Lost for others. I should resistance communication. Tracking the aliens' progress on this avatar project here. Here we go. If they finish what they've started, it sounds like it'll be the end for all of us. Here we go. Ramon Nieves, Geraldine Ryan, J. Fitzgerald, Kenji Yamada. It's a lot of people. Let's go meet them. Now we've got 20 people at least. Or 22, I think. What was that all about? 22 people in our barracks. Which is nice. Start with Ramoho. Wowza. Ramon. You look like you've seen some shit. A young kid from the streets of Mexico City, Ramon has a habit of getting I into did trouble. My best to get the new recruits ready for what they're going up against, but having the commander back is a bigger confidence boost than any speech. At least it's relevant because we just recruited some new people. His cunning and selfish nature led him to surviving on his own for quite some time before finally getting apprehended by Advent forces. Thankfully, a resistance recruiter had been keeping an eye on him and arranged a rescue operation. He's been fighting with the resistance ever since, happy to deliver pain to the aliens. Right, we've got an ex-con on the ship. Awesome, welcome. 
Geraldine G. Force Ryan, a member of the U.S. Air Force, Geraldine was quite the breakout pilot and served during the initial invasion. She didn't last long in the sky, however, and has been crowned ever since. Though she hopes to one day take to the skies once again, Bradford insists that Firebrand pilots the Sky Ranger, and Geraldine remains a backup. Oh, how unfortunate. It's okay, I'm sure you'll do fine down on the ground. J. Bulletproof Fitzgerald, once a DJ of a highly popular electronic music station in Toronto, Jay never dreamed of a world where he'd be shooting guns rather than spinning dicks. Alas, here he is, doing his best to keep spirits high on the Avenger, with his cheerful persona, but on the field he struggles to fight the fear that he could die in a flash. Kenji Emperor Yamada. Kenji is a former police officer based out of Nagasaki, another cop. A fast and loose cop. Kenji hated the paperwork but loved hunting down the bad guys. At least he doesn't have to fill out forms anymore when it comes to fighting back against the aliens. Uh, you'd be surprised, actually, how much paperwork XCOM actually does. Uh, you just... we don't show you that stuff, much like a police procedural doesn't really show the paperwork style of things on TV shows. But, hey, welcome, guys. Maybe I should chuck one of you in here. Uh, let's give maybe... Uh, let's give Bulletproof some confidence, since he's afraid of being out in the field. Maybe we'll... Let you be a sharpshooter so you can stay out in the back. Got to add Lisk and Ling talking. I think her name's Penny. She's still in the school even though she's finished her training. Um, let's go for the regular supplies. We're going to need them very soon. Because we're going to do some building. But the debris almost cleared. That's going to be more supplies boosted. Like, I'd love to do that grill op, but with the fatigue we've got, it's going to be a bit annoying. Hey, Seuss, down there. Let's hold off on building something just yet. Actually, you know what? Let's build the power relay. I will see them crumble. The chosen are gonna do whatever and then we don't need an engineer to building to you, it, so Even you can leave that wiping out entire camps of resistance while we uh, excavate. We're their only line of defense. There we go, supply raid. We're gonna be swimming in supplies soon. Operation Demon Storm. Resistance contacts undercover civilians present in this combat zone. Setting course for <sighs> Sector Eight, Mexico. Let's move back to Mexico. Commander, I'm getting faint traces of a signal coming through. Someone on the ground is trying to reach us, but I can't make it out. Keep your eyes peeled for possible contacts down there. Will do. In the meantime, let me sort out the team. Be right back. All right, Operation Demon Storm. We're taking out Fernandez, Johnson, Yellow, Ross, Norris, Adlisk, and Zhao. We'll do this next time. Thank you guys so much for joining me in this episode of A Better Everything. I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Goodbye.